This next story was about a couple named Sherry and Ed, who had also been keeping a secret, you know, not from each other, but from their grown daughter, Shannon. As you're about to see, this secret had the potential to change all of their lives in a profound way. 23 years ago, Sherry and Ed got married and gave birth to a beautiful baby girl named Shannon. Now, I have to tell you that these two people out here have known each other since junior high school. They were high school sweethearts. They are the loves of each other. Can you imagine that? And they have been married now 23 years, happily. Now, they gave birth to this young, beautiful girl named Shannon, and from the moment Shannon was born, Sherry and Ed have been keeping a deep, dark secret from their daughter, a secret they always knew would break Shannon's heart if it were revealed. So today, Sherry and Ed's daughter, Shannon, is a grown woman, and Sherry and Ed now feel, after all this time, that it's time for them to reveal their secret to Shannon, no matter how painful it may be. Sounds serious. It is. Okay. So, what about this young girl? She's beautiful. She's, she's like a best friend to me. Our kids are really close to us. Because Have there's another daughter, close. Yes. a 20-year-old. Yes, and... The um, secret doesn't involve her, but she's going to have to be told. Her name is Tara, and she's backstage. Yes, she is. What's the secret? Well, um, Ed and I have been dating a long time, and we broke up for a little while. He went his own way, and I went to Korea. In the I service? I joined the service. And I ended up, um, he started dating other girls, and I found myself a boyfriend. And so I dated him for a couple months, and then I found out I was pregnant. Right. Well, I was so in love with Ed. All I wanted to believe is it was Ed's child. So I wrote him a letter and, and told him that I'm pregnant and I'm coming home. And um, when I came home, I told him there was a possibility that it might not be his. Right. But he says it will be his. Didn't matter. Didn't matter. You ready for this? Huh? Totally. Now, we're going to bring her out in a moment, and before we do, this is what Shannon had to say about the thought of hearing a secret from her parents, who she loves so much. My name is Shannon. I'm 23 years old. I'm here to hear a secret from my mom. My mom and I are really close. We're best friends. I don't understand why she'd be bringing me here to tell me a secret. My mom and dad have been married for 23 years. We're such a loving and close family. I just don't understand where there could be a secret. My dad is a really gentle and wonderful man, and he's, he's the best dad anyone could ever have. I can't possibly imagine what the secret could be, because me and my mom are just so close, and it's, it's been hard. I've been racking my brain. I just can't wait to get the secret out and open, because it's really bothering me. I see my parents every single day, and, and I just can't wait to get this out in the open and figure out what's going on. Now, here's Shannon. Shannon, come on in. Good, it's a, good to see you. I think you know these two people. Yeah. Huh? Wow. You're, you, you look confused. I am. <laughs> I bet you are. Well, let me, let me just reveal one thing that you don't know about. Your mom's going to reveal her secret, but your dad knows. So I know you knew your dad was going to be out here. You didn't know whether he knew. He knows. No, and now you're looking at your mom and you're yeah. upset. You're upset. Okay, okay, my secret is I dated another man when I was in Korea. And it's a possibility that he's your father and dad is not your biological father. It's just possible. It's just the possibility, Shannon, but it's always been there. Well, who is he? Um, his name is And I don't know, uh, I don't know where he lives or anything like that. This happened when your mom and your dad were broken up. And they I was gone. in Korea. 
When you were in the army. When I was in the army. She met Korea. him over there. And I dated him. Your dad was dating other people, and I dated him. And and, and that, two months after I was in, I found out I was pregnant. And I'm really sorry that I didn't tell you sooner, Shannon. But I wanted dad. Dad and I were just. We said, well, Shannon has a lot of things that she looks like that. Do I look like the other guy? There's a possibility. Do I look like him? <laughs> you, you, when you were small. To me, I yes. look like my dad. I'm, okay. I'm sorry, sweetie. But it's always been a non-issue, uh -oh. Shannon. It's, it's just been, been a non-issue because it's never you're, been an issue with you're us. my daughter no matter what. Want to go back and tell Tara? When mom was when mom was younger and in, in Korea, she was on leave, and she was with dad. When she went back to Korea, she was with a guy named. <laughs> and two months later, she found out she was pregnant with me, and she was a month late. It's I could be. It's a possibility. It's a I could be. Daughter, not dad. It's been hard Before me and mom tell. got married, I knew. I told Dad but right off. it didn't off. matter. We were going to spend the rest of our lives together. So it didn't matter. We're, we're all mm -hmm. the same family. We used to joke. We used to joke. I'm so sorry. It'll be okay. It'll, It'll be, be okay. 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 We'll be back after this. So after that show, we gave everybody a DNA test. And 48 hours later, which seemed, you know, like a lifetime to all of them, the results finally came in, and here's what happened. Let's see what happened. When it comes to Shannon, Ed, you are the father in Ed. Yes! something to celebrate. You are not the father. <laughs>